at seven of those helpers. Officials tonight, Roger Ayers, Doug Shows, and Joe Lindsay. And it will be Louisville controlling the opening tip. Right out of the gate, a turnover for Louisville. And went off that loss to DePaul on the road, and they started off very sluggishly in that game. Losing to DePaul on the road because this is a very poor DePaul team so far this season. Another turnover. That's four the other way. Freddie Hicks for the easy two. And right now, Louisville. Well, that's just way too easy, though. Huntley Hatfield just posted up, carved the space out on the box, and no resistance from Louisville. Strong move inside by Caleb Fields. Fifth-year senior and a five-year starter. Kenny Payne telling us earlier today, this team has to buy into we, not me, as that time they left the back door open and Arkansas State makes them pay. And Kenny Payne is challenging his veterans, the transfers. Well, sometimes when you put new pieces together that fits, and sometimes like Oklahoma has done this year. Well, Johnson is one guy that can come into the lineup and run the team and more efficiently than others. He's got a decent assist to turnover ratio, which, but I still think you need a balance. Well, you got to defend the post right there. Isaiah Nelson wide open. Just a lack of communication. Mark the catch and shoot. He's got four. He's so hard to defend when he's coming off those screens because he's quick, he's fast, he's got that quick release. Seven zero run for Louisville. Hicks twisting inside for two. This is how we play. We need a good stretch four on the floor at all times. Feltz wanted the three. It's not there. And they get the other three off the wing at Arkansas State with a two-point lead in the final four minutes of the first half. Good offense that time. And Louisville a little late on the closeout on. White, little hesitation. Clark, the baseline drive. Good ball movement. Comes back to James. Driving to the basket and one. Through the first couple of months of the season, so they are accustomed to being on the road. Fields, the drive, the dish. Isaiah Nelson, the flush. He's got eight. Nelson cleans. Good move by Johnson. Just took his eye off the rim and again. His man fell down. Here's White the other way. Numbers for Louisville. White all the way. Looking at the monitor to see if there was a shot clock issue. Dominguez, green lights it. Tap back, it comes to Fields. On the low block, that's Freddie Hicks going to work. And he gets rewarded with two shots. Freddie Hicks is in on all the players because obviously they've been taught how to defend the pick and roll. I mean, if you're going to double the pick and roll, somebody has to rotate down. And Arkansas State's largest lead of the game was seven. Fields, the basket, the foul, and a chance to extend to seven. Hicks, they are taking the ball to the basket. There's the three, and Arkansas State with a double-digit lead. Guarded by the freshman, veteran and Greenhorn. Down the lane, Hicks again. A game-high 16 for the junior. Passes out of a double team. 15 to shoot. White, the dribble drive. He gets that one, but Tim, that's kind of been the story for Louisville. It's Everyone's got to get involved, and you see it in their assist-to-turnover ratio. It's just not good enough. Meanwhile, everything falling. Clark kicks it out to James. He'll pass on the three, and James will have a chance at the three the old-fashioned way. In the painted area, no, the flush by Nelson. 
back side of that zone just collapsed and got in got into the middle into the we go back in the man to man trying to put a little pressure on the perimeter and all the way to the rim Curtis Williams guarding Fields another blow by and another chance at a three point play Caleb Fields has been a man been three in 271 consecutive games. Todd, completely uncontested again. Louisville led by two at the break. Arkansas State shot 51% from the field after halftime.